Bristol, 5th of March, 1759, to Captain James M. Taggart. We appoint you commander of our snow swift, and order you to embrace the first fair wind or good opportunity of sailing with your complement being 30 in number, directly for the River Bonny on the coast of Africa. And when you arrive there, and are safe over the bar, endeavour to come to the knowledge of what are the best openings for trade, and to open trade with the natives on the best terms you can, and barter the whole of our cargo for as many fine, young and healthy, full-grown Negroes, men, boys and women girls as it will admit. We appoint you commander of our Snow Africa and desire you to repair on board her in King's Road with your ship's company and to make the best of your way to New Calabar on the coast of Africa. You have a cargo on board on our accounts amounting to £4,648, one shilling and a penny, which you are to barter for good, healthy young Negroes and ivory and will desire you to be very careful in the purchase of the Negroes, not to buy any old slaves or children, but good, healthy young men and women. And buy all the ivory you can, and when you are half slave, don't stay long if there is a possibility of getting off, for the rise of sickness and mortality then becomes great. We recommend to you the care of your white people, for when your crew is healthy, they will be able to take care of the Negroes. Signed, John Kilcott, John Anderson, T.H. Lucas and James Rogers. So, one more tweet and then I think we should head on. <laughs> 